Um, settle down, everyone. Excuse me. Yeah, Russell will be here shortly, and he'll take you through everything then, okay? But until then, just a bit of shush. Here we are. My top 13. Look at you. Fantastic. Are we feeling excited in the room? Are we all excited? Yep. Are we all excited? Yeah. 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 Yes, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is now my pleasure and privilege to present to you the one and only Russell Davies. Now, Russell has been working with some of the yeah, best. Mate, 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 I think we've got a fair idea of who I am. Who's this guy? No idea. <coughs> now, I know that this would be quite intimidating for you people to be in the presence of someone such as myself, but I want to assure you, I'm only human, right? Okay. With my help, you, or some of you, are going to become superstars. At the end of the day, you'll be able to say, Russell Davis made me. Um, Go ahead, mate, far away. Excuse me, Mr. Davis, don't mean to be rude, but um, aren't we all here because we are the best of the best and we all obviously have talent? Look, uh, I, I really like your confidence there, Kamal, but you know, confidence only get you so far, won't it, mate? Hey? You've got to ask yourself a question. If you're so talented, what are you doing sitting in a room full of all these other so-called talented people? Why aren't you out there selling a million records? Mm. Answer me that, somebody, somebody, somebody. You, Chips, got any ideas? Oh, um, is it because we haven't had the opportunity yet or we haven't met the right person to help us along the way? Ease up there, sweater, ease up, all right? Okay, look, the thing is you're not really answering the main question, are you? Why is it that none of you have already had that opportunity? Hmm? Now, all of you have one thing in common. And let me tell you, it's not your singing. So, what is it? Is it that we've all entered this competition? Oh, well, bugger me. Looks like we've got an Einstein in the room, doesn't it? Eh? <laughs> so I was right. Uh, no. See, I was being facetious. Which, by the look of you, is a word that you probably don't even understand. No, I have no idea. Exactly. Actually, I was being facetious. Oh, hello. Pretty boys had a bit of a light bulb idea, yes. Is it I'm going to stop you and save you a lot of time and embarrass me. I'm going to tell you what you have in common. Now, the common denominator here is that all of you, apart from me, of course, are fairly unattractive people. I mean, let's face it, some of you are borderline ugly, all right? There's not one of you that I'd probably look twice at if I was walking down the street. Apart from maybe you. <laughs> but I'm guessing you're not a very good singer. You're probably here for a couple of other reasons. But it's okay, right? Because with my experience and expertise, we can change all of that. We can get the public to connect with you, all right? Looks become irrelevant because it's all about the backstory. Mm -hmm. You see, it's marketing and it's genius, okay? Now, now, before you all thank me, I want you all to have a look at this. Now, have a look at those lines up there and see if any of those attributes actually suit you. Flash up, I can do that. I can do that. Serious. So who wants to be a secret alcoholic? Hmm? Rat boy, that can be you. Sounds good to me, Russ. Um, uh, so, uh, Russ, what if you're a stereotype that isn't listed up there? What do you mean? I mean, well, we obviously want the uh, public to vote for us, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the best way to do that is to appeal to their sympathetic side, right? <laughs> well, what if I was to say that I was, in fact, from the Stolen Generation. The Stolen Generation? Well, I guess I'd say... Uh, sorry. <laughs> actually, mate, that's genius. That's actually very, very smart. But, I mean, man, look at you, you know? I couldn't even pass you off as a half-cast, could I? So why don't you just leave the thinking to me, right, mate? I mean, this is what I do, you know? So I digress. So where were we? Uh, let's see. Uh, who wants to be molested as a child? I want to be molested. You want to be a molested Aboriginal stolen generation kid with red hair? Yes sir, yes. And I was thinking um, maybe I could be gay as well. But I'm actually gay. Me too. No, 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 no. you boys can't be gay. I mean, Buffett over there, he could be gay or Rat Boy there if we're desperate. But not you two, but look at you. You're there to split the teenage female vote. That's important to us. Now back in the closet, both of you. Well, well let me be gay. Look, see. I could be gay. No, stop that. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You're not gay. All right. Stop it. 
Just stop it, right? Yeah. Now, look, mate, okay, you've probably got a fantastic singing voice. You're probably a great singer, okay? Yeah, Judging by the way you look, that's probably why you're here, mate, all right? Hey, so, you know, the, the ring I think could work for you, you know? Maybe they could get you extra votes, get you across the line. Let's use that, Paul. I mean, kids all over Australia will be wearing red rings just to support you. Great, okay, fine. <clears throat> right, so where were we? Oh, yeah, who was being molested? Molested, molested, somebody, yeah, you. You look kind of innocent. You were molested as a child, but you don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Excellent, very good, that's already done. Okay, now, a lesbian. Who's going to be our lesbian? Hey, give me a bit, Russ, Russ, lesbian, lesbian. Shut up, blood nut. Lesbian, come on, lesbian, somebody, somebody, lesbian, lesbian. Shut up. You can have this shit idea, Russ. I knew we should have gone with the afro. <laughs> Wait a minute, Shannon, mate. It wasn't the fro. You didn't want to be the virgin. That's what got him over the line. Virgin? I'm married with kids, you idiot. That's your problem, Shannon. It's showbiz. Oh, thanks, me, oh, Russ. You're a genius. There you go. Thank you, guy. Now, you see, now that there is a winner, all right? There's a man who went the whole nine yards, okay? There's a man who was a triple threat. He's from a Muslim family. Huh? He's a guitar playing, wig wearing, Christian, and he's a virgin. But not you. You didn't want to be the virgin, did you? Oh, no. I want to be the country boy with a stupid old flavour saver. You've lost the plot, mate. I'm out of here. I can make it without you. Good luck with that, mate, yeah. And by the way, I think you might be taking the lyrics a bit too seriously. It's not all about you. All right, let's see, let's... Oh, yeah, now, this year, I think we'll have a wheelchair. Because I reckon that uh, a cripple is the new black. Wheelchair! Oh, oh for fuck.